see, I, it all made sense to me when I saw them um, coaching each other at the Evo, uh, when you got to see them on stream and kind of helping each other out. Tekken runs through their blood. I mean, they look exactly the same. It's kind of scary. <laughs> same haircut and everything. Oh, yeah, I do remember now. And I'm sitting here like, wait, there's another Azim qu like, question mark? I was like, what? Cloned, possibly? No. Twin brother, finding that out was wild. Also, should probably hit up Slowpoke later for some coaching, trying to get better at King. But besides that, this whole day and then the past weekend for Tekken has been an insane one, to say the least. Like, I was up very late watching Evo and then going into Grand Finals is just as crazy. A lot of good moments there, too. Yeah, like I said, Wizzy, uh, just coming off of a top 10 finish at Evo. Uh, and for those who don't know, Evo had the highest attendee rate ever in Tekken history. I mean, ever from all the way from Tekken one, all the way till now, we had 4,600 people attend Evo this year just for Tekken alone. And Rhythm finishing top 10. This dude is pretty good. Honestly, it's not even a matter of like pretty good. That's like very good, especially off like the past couple of wins that Rhythm has had previously. And then going into, you know, this week of breakout esports and seeing not only just like the people that we've stuck with thus far, but some newer names as well, at least to me, being able to see a panda on stream, at least wreck a couple of people was a little surprising because that was Servbot, right? <laughs> yeah, Servbot uh, got kind of No, he uh, Servbot played against... um. Raylo. Yeah, previously. Uh, Slowpoke defeated... Who did he defeat? He defeated AIM-2. That's who it was. Which, it, I'm not being biased or anything, which, you know, so, so it is still cool to see King in these matches. Let's be very real here. I would say, you saying I'm not trying to be biased is sounds like about to be the most biased thing ever to come out of your mouth. <laughs> That's the thing. I get commentators are supposed to be unbiased, but when it comes to King, I mean, I really can't help it in a lot of situations, but this time around, we are going for that robot on robot violence, or cyborg, question mark, depending on who you ask. It's going to be Crush versus Aimed 2, Jack 8 versus Alyssa. Yes, we're actually going to start off on the loser side. Okay, and by the way, I don't want to discredit uh, Mr. Joe Moggin Crush, because this uh -oh. man finished 25th at Evo, so he's also no joke. But you gotta take on, gotta take on one of the best Alyssa players I know, Aim Two. He's been rocking Alyssa ever since release, and he's been doing a, doing monstrous things. Plant the seed, down back one plus two right there, back one plus two again. Could have converted into heat as well, pretty much turning into a safe mid. And just like that, first round going over to Joe Crush. Oh, he was ducking and it got oh. back up. And speaking of safety, really, if anything, that wasn't exactly the safest thing you could do. And Aim 2, taking initiative now, at least want to go on those hop kicks, but still counted by Joe Crush going for that power crush in itself, straight in the heat. Oh, boy. Oh, caught him on the last uh -oh. hit, but it didn't confirm. He tried to do back 3-2 right there. Must have got full charge. Back 2! Careful, Gamma Howl. He's got heat still. He could spend it. Spends the heat burst, but went underneath it. One more hit. Uh-oh, oh, did he press? Rage Art? No! Oh. Didn't get him right there. Thought he was going to be swinging. But again, the evasiveness. Really scaring even the top level players. Scares him into a Rage Art. What? I keep getting traumatized by that too. You know how horrible it was during an actual tournament that I was playing as a kid and getting hit with a one, two, three, four, five. Happened to me full stop what do and I never do? again. And as I say that, seven golden letters coming in full effect for Joe Crush here. Now he's up by one and straight into heat again. One, two, power move. And the wall shoulder blow is still in flames. We're getting knocked down himself. How is that not counter hit? I, I'm, I'm calling robbery for aim two right there. And a down back one to close it out. Super good stuff for Joe Crush. It would look a little, a little dicey that first round uh, once aim two kind of got his footing. But again, Joe Crush making the adaptations, really showing off the uh, the knowledge that he's got with Jack. Relying a little too heavily on some of those safe mids, but if it works, it works. And especially being able to transition a lot of the heat bursts. And listen, you love raw damage, you love the raw power that is Jack 8. Honestly, Joe Crush just makes him look terrifying like the behemoth that he is. And I say that just stands up with the saws, aim too, not for that raw pressure. Not even a break through that armor, though. One more hit. Caught him ducking right there. Really good. And this is a kind of similar start to last time, so hopefully AIM-2 can kind of shift the tides a little bit because uh, this is exactly how it started. Oh! Uh -oh. Bow! Pile driver. 
Those are the more damage option. Doesn't go into heat quite yet. Uh-oh. Full crouch 1-1. One, one. Nice duck! Gamma Hall 4 is a high. Gotta duck those. Should be able to get wall here. A little side wall, but still got the combo conversion. Just back against the wall. I mean, quite literally with the stun into just going straight to that combo conversion. And off the stance too. Saw's back out Ooh. with the diving head first. Now aim two, at least up by two in the round, but Joker's still at one in the set. Uh -oh. One, one, open up the pressure. Nice side movement right there. Lateral movement, super important right there. Usually a high you have to duck, but I didn't know you can actually sidestep it. Uh -oh. You can also duck that. Boom, full conversion. Forward, one, two, one. Uh-uh, brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr